Hello boys and girls. For our social studies lesson today, we will be talking about two celebrations, Ramalila and Diwali. Let's first talk about Ramalila. Ramalila is a celebration that takes place in our country. It is celebrated by a group of persons known as Hindus in our country. Ramalila is celebrated 10 days before Diwali. Ramalila tells the story of two persons named Lord Rama and Sita. The story tells us that Sita was saved from an evil king named Rawan. It talks about how good triumphs over evil. Here are some pictures showing Ramalila celebrations taking place in savannas in Trinidad. Here we see Lord Rama and Sita, his wife, acted out by Hindus. In this picture, we see the evil demon, Rawan. And in the last picture, we see him being defeated. Ramalila speaks about good triumphing over evil. It leads up to Diwali celebrations. Let's now talk about Diwali. Diwali is celebrated by Hindus also. Diwali is celebrated at the end of the year, usually around October or November. It takes place on the darkest day of the year. Diwali is known as the Festival of Lights. Diwali means light over darkness and it also means good over evil. So let's find out how Hindus celebrate Diwali. The first thing that Hindus do, they clean their homes. For Diwali, their homes must be very, very clean. Hindus pray for Diwali. They visit Hindu temples to pray. This picture shows the inside of a Hindu temple. They also have special prayers at home and these prayers are called puja. Hindus pray to Mother Lakshmi because she is known as the goddess of light. They believe that she brings prosperity to their homes when they pray to her. Hindus also fast to celebrate Diwali. So what is fasting? Fasting means that they only eat vegetarian meals, vegetables and fruits, things like rice and peas. Fasting means staying away from all meat. For Diwali, Hindus dress in their Indian wear. The girls or ladies wear garara like this one here they wear saris 
as shown in the picture. They also wear shawl was. And in this picture, the lady is wearing a shawl was. The boys wear kurtas, which is the top part of their clothing. They also wear dhotis, which is the bottom part of their clothing. On Diwali day, a big Diwali meal is prepared. Here are some examples of food prepared for Diwali. Roti, chana and aloo or potato and curried mango. As you can see, all vegetarian meal. Dalpuri, a vegetable called shatine or bodhi. On Diwali day, Hindus also prepare many sweets. Let's look at a few examples. Barfi, Kurma, Jalebi, Ladu, and Parsad. But the most important thing on Diwali day is the lighting of the diyas. The diyas are special clay pots that the Hindus fill with oil and a wick. It makes a special lamp for them to light on Diwali day. Here are some more pictures showing children lighting diyas. In this picture, they light deers on bamboo. Here are the clay pots, also known as deers. And here are some deers displayed on bamboo. Thank you for listening, boys and girls.